right, so I'm going to demonstrate how to end your thread and add a new thread. You want to go ahead and do this before your thread gets too short. Um, so stop when you still have about six inches of thread left. And instead of taking your next stitch, you're going to go down into the next couple of beads. We're going to weave this tail in by following the thread path as much as we can. I'm just going to follow the thread back in the way that it went before, and then I'm going to tie the thread off and add in new thread. All right, so to tie off the thread, what I do is pick up the bar of thread that runs between two stitches. Right next to where your thread is exiting. So if you can see, the, ta the tip of the needle has picked up this bar of thread that runs between this seed bead and this super duo. I'm going to take my tail, the tail of thread, and wrap it twice around the tip of the needle. Once, twice. Then I'm going to pull it down, snug, pinch it, and pull the needle through. This forms a little tiny knot. Then I'm just going to feed this back through a couple more beads, and then I'll snip it. All right. So that's in and secure. I'm going to trim it close to the beadwork. And then I'm going to start with a new piece of thread. All right, so I'm all ready with my new piece of thread. Thread it onto my needle. I'm going to stitch it back into the work. I'm going to start below where I want the thread to come out. I'm going to stitch through a couple of beads to start and pull through until the tail of the thread there's our tail don't pull it all the way through until the tail of the thread is a few inches long then again we're going to tie a little knot here we're going to pick up a, the bar that goes between two stitches so wrap it, snug it down, pinch, and pull it through. This is just going to anchor it with a nice little knot. And then we can continue weaving up to get back to where our thread should be exiting. We want our thread to exit in the same spot that it would have been exiting previously. So we took this stitch down through this bead and up through this super duo. So we want our thread to be exiting this super duo. So I'm just going to weave over bead by bead. Don't cut your tail. And here we are now exiting the same bead that we would have exited previously with our original thread. And now you're ready to continue stitching. You can come down and snip off this little tail. There you go.